I mean, you know, in part you have to show people that they have it. You know, I suspect you know there's there's an immense appetite out there for almost all sorts of knowledge, really, um, um, and it has somehow to be mobilised, and it depends on people being spokes. Persons. And I think from from the academy. I mean, I think that it's it really is important to share with people the kinds of arguments we really have, because that's when they get interested, and that's when you're interested. Yeah? And I, I mean, I think people often say to me, "Look, um, surely doing telly isn't that you know? Don't you find that really different from?" what you do with undergraduates. You know, you teach at Cambridge. Um, and you say, well, it isn't really. I mean, if you, if, particularly if you take first-year undergraduates, they're clever, but people who turn on telly programmes about the Romans are not stupid. You know, so, you know uh, um, and they, the, the approach you have and the issues that you try to interest people with and the kind of material you try to get over, it's just the same with undergraduates as it is with a television audience. I mean, you might try to avoid some technical terms, but you're trying to teach the undergraduates some technical terms. You're slightly trying to avoid that with, um, uh, on television. But by and large, the, you know, when my undergraduates look at my television programmes, I'm absolutely certain that they recognise the kind of arguments that we've been having. And I, th- and I think that I, mean, I, I think the, the the pledge you have to make to people if you want to talk to them widely about it is that you're not going to dumb down. They smell it a bloody mile off. Yeah? It's got. Um, don't, don't you worry, you're pretty little about this. But I'll tell you a simple version of the story, which of course I don't believe. And they, you know, they sniff it. Undergrads as well, then. Yes. Yes, everybody smells it. And so why do it? 